From our North Idaho newsroom, a local soldier, lots of them, hundreds of them, their families and friends are bracing for an emotional year apart. Members of the 116th Cavalry Brigade Combat Team were deployed today to Iraq as part of Operation New Dawn. KXLY 4's Tanya Dahl attended this morning's send-off. It's, it's a lot of people and it's pretty busy right now, but uh, you know, it's, it's good to have family here and friends and get ready to take off. Saying goodbye is never easy, even with packed bags sitting nearby. Oh my goodness, it's, it's hard. It's very hard to see him deploy, but um, my son is excited about going. He does have a mission and he is so army. These civilians turned soldiers soaked up hugs and kisses from loved ones, cherished time to take snapshots and shed parting tears. In April, the Department of Defense announced that the 116th Cavalry Brigade Combat Team would be mobilized. Since then, it's been a waiting game for deployment day. My best friends, mom and dad, my mom and dad were here with my daughter, my brother, my sister-in-law, my best friend, everybody's here to see me off, so it's good. This is Specialist Marisa Bradbury's second deployment, but this time around she's 25 and leaving someone special behind. I was 19 and I was so excited to see a different country. I loved the first deployment. I actually had a lot of fun. This one's going to be a little harder because I have a baby girl, so it's just a little bit harder. The Idaho National Guard says 1,500 citizen soldiers from across the state, 275 from North Idaho, will take part in Operation New Dawn. The U.S. military says combat-related missions formerly performed by coalition forces are now being handled by the Iraqi military. So the 116th CBCT will provide convoy and military installation security, along with logistical support for military and civilian agency delegations traveling in Iraq. We are just going to be doing force protection, so it's, it's going to be a little, hopefully, low-key, I hope. <laughs> That's what I'm praying for. As the hour quickly passes, these hometown heroes know it's time to say goodbye and focus on the mission ahead. So they have orders, you know, and we just have to wait. This deployment is expected to last for at least 12 months. Reporting from North Idaho, Tanya Dahl, KXLY4, HD News.